The next article is colligative properties. When a non-volatile solute is dissolved in a solvent, a solution is obtained if the concentration of the solute in the solution is low, then the solution is said to be dilute. We shall be mainly dealing with dilute solutions in this chapter. Those properties of a dilute solution which depend only upon the number of solute particles but not upon the nature of solute particles are called colligative properties. The examples of colligative properties are number one, osmotic pressure, number two, lowering in vapor pressure, number three, elevation of boiling point, and finally number four, depression of freezing point. We shall study all these colligative properties in detail in the same sequence in which these are listed above. Let us begin our study with osmosis and osmotic pressure. Osmosis, it is defined as a spontaneous movement of solvent particles from a dilute solution or from pure solvent towards concentrated solution through a semi-permeable membrane SPM. Illustration of osmosis. Let us take a thistle funnel having one end open and lower end covered by a semi-permeable membrane. SPM allows solvent to pass through it but not the solute. A solution of a non-volatile solute, say sugar, in water is placed in it. The funnel is clamped vertically and partially dipped in water as shown in the following figure A. Since osmosis is a spontaneous process, hence water solvent flows from beaker into the funnel through SPM and after some time the level of the solution inside the funnel refer figure B becomes stationary. Say after rising a height H indicating the equilibrium state where no net osmosis is taking place.